Hey, Zelda Nation, William here, and this video is clickbait. But is it really? I'm sure you all saw the thumbnail and instantly thought, hey, let's click and check it out, and are wondering why this video has no relevance to said image. Long story short, you got clickbaited. But did you really? The thumbnail may tell you to click on it and entice you with some somewhat suggestive fan art of a fictional character without the implication of this all being a lie, but the title does still tell you that the video in itself is clickbait. But if you're going in knowing that you'll be clickbaited, and you do get clickbaited, you're not actually being clickbaited because you entered with the knowledge I'm lying to you, which in itself isn't a lie because I was truthful about lying to you making it true. Objection! But then, that means I was being honest about the thumbnail and did indeed clickbait you. But clickbait is generally seen as advertising something either untruthful or exaggerated to the point of it being a borderline lie. So I'm not clickbaiting you, meaning that the video's title is a lie, but then it's true since I managed to deceive you into clicking this video where you were lied to matching the title of the video, except it's not matching the title since I already marked this video as being clickbait. Except it isn't. And it also is. Guys, I, I think I just created a paradox. But wait a second, when you think about it, the definition of clickbait is technically content whose main purpose is to attract attention and encourage visitors to click on a link to a particular web page. The whole point of a YouTuber is to make their videos stand out with compelling titles and attractive thumbnails compared to the rest of the website's content. By that definition, everyone is clickbaiting. It doesn't have to be a lie. The only reason the term is viewed in a negative light is because it's mainly brought up when you mislead people. And by that definition, the entire context of the situation changes. This video does indeed lie to you, but it still falls under the clickbait category as its main purpose is to bring in an audience with the thumbnail and title. Therefore, this video is indeed clickbait. But what if I'm lying about this? What if, while I'm telling you this is the textbook definition of clickbait, it isn't, and I'm misleading you for views? Then we're back at square one. Have I unintentionally split the world into two timelines with the creation of this video? One where the video is technically clickbait, and the other where I've created a paradox by stating the video is by definition misleading when it technically isn't? <sighs> I think I need to go lie down for a bit, guys. Hey guys, and thank you for making it to the end of this video. And happy April Fools, I guess, even though it's most likely the day after since I'm working on this very late into the night. I've got more Zelda videos in the works currently, so stay tuned for more of that on the channel. I've been Nintendo Black Crisis, and I'll see you all next time.